The celebration began with a parade, a fitting start to a momentous day. The Children's Hospital is not about bricks and mortar or steel, concrete and glass. You can dream, you can create, and you can design, but their vision requires people to make it a reality. We really want to have a healing environment for the families. Hundreds gathered to usher in a new era in children's health care in Hollywood, realized in a state-of-the-art facility designed to help and heal children. I think it's a great day. I think it's a great opportunity for the community, for the children of the community, for the parents of the community to have a place to come where they feel comfortable and feel welcomed. I started here almost 30 years ago, and when I started here, the medical building was just two stories, the children's floor and another story, and now we have this. Since its inception, Joe DiMaggio Children's has gone from being a small unit within Memorial Regional to becoming a full-scale pediatric hospital. When I arrived, even in the large hospital of Memorial, we had exactly places for six people in the emergency room, one full-time doctor. The new freestanding Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital is a four-story, 180,000 square foot facility that showcases an overall power of play theme with floors featuring sports, arts, games, or dreams. The work of children is play, and so that's their job. You know, you and I get up and go to a 95, kids get up and play, that's what they're supposed to do. And so by helping them be normalized by being able to play here, it helps to help, get, help them get better faster. <laughs> Nurse Christine took four children on a behind the scenes tour to kid test the hospital before the first patients checked in. This is kind of like my, my school. Kind of cool, really? Yeah. Where we are right now is the interactive, the interactive play space, which obviously your children are making very good use of. Um, it's, it is, we specifically designed, designed it for the different developmental levels of the kids. So out in the out in the front area is an area where like little ones can just kind of crawl around and be interactive. And then as you get older, you want to run through the maze of the Swiss cheese, and then really testing the gross motor skills with you know being able to turn the handles and be able to watch and see what's going on up here. Just a place for them to burn. Let off some steam <laughs> inside where it's safe and it's air conditioned, so it's very cool. It has holes that we can go through and red things, so when we're playing tag, we can change the basic Ow! the colors here, except for purple. The colorful surroundings disguise a world of medical expertise and equipment designed to treat children coping with everything from cancer and heart defects to broken bones and childhood diseases. There are 204 beds, six pediatric operating rooms, radiology services, and an entire floor dedicated to pediatric oncology patients. Now we have a fully dedicated floor for just oncology hematology patients, so they go to one place to get their inpatient and outpatient care. We have a dialysis unit that can do up to 30 patients a day. In the pediatric radiology area, children don't just get a CT scan. They take a ride in a pirate ship complete with accessories to distract them from the procedure. Because there's a tube, we want to try and make it as kid friendly as possible, so we made it a pirate ship and, you know, Spirit of Pirates of the Caribbean to try and get the kids totally relaxed about coming in here. So they think they're on a ride, almost like they're walking the plank. See how the light comes on? They can try their hand at performing their own CT on a stuffed bear to get even more comfortable with the process. No, you don't have to push any buttons. See, there's his brain. On the fourth floor, an atrium allows children who may not be able to go outside to see and feel the sun and listen to the sounds of trickling water. An inspiring message forms a maze for children to follow. It was written by a young cancer patient, Daniela Felico, who spent many months in treatment. It's a restful place that embodies her uplifting spirit. Danielle loved the, loved the, the sea and the, been the beach and everything, and the one thing she always wished when she was in the hospital was to be able to have the feel of the sun on her face. So we made this part of the oncology floor so the oncology patients who can't go outside because they might catch something from the, you and I just walking around, we gave them this space so that they could always have a place to have the sun on their face. So what we have here? In each patient room, a Get Well network provides a multimedia playground for kids. They can surf the internet, watch educational programming, movies, even play video games. These five-star accommodations offer room service, allowing families to order food 24 hours a day. 
Here at the new JDCH, unparalleled patient care comes together with play in a hospital committed to healing both the body and spirit. It's like priceless and you don't know it until you're a part of it.